<laughs> Break the eye. The music guy. I'm Fred Stein, the music guy. Well, it has been made and played by Aboriginal people for thousands of years. Now, the Aborigine would also listen to the sounds of wind, thunder, trees creaking, and water running. The essences of all these sounds were played with as much accuracy as possible within the droning sound of the didgeridoo. There's another spelling. So today, we're gonna make our own didgeridoos, sort of. Now the actual didgeridoo as I'll be showing you later, is made from wood, from uh, a part of a tree. However, I found out recently about how we can make something similar out of a PVC pipe. And so we want it to have some texture and uh, so that we can paint on it, you see? And uh, it's kind of, it's not a very fun job. It's uh, kind of nasty. So I've been taking the tubes and I actually, uh, I sanded them up real well. And I also took the, uh, the file thingy here and I, and I did that all over and stuff. And then I sanded them with some paper. And now I'm taking my acrylic paints. Oh yeah, also I, I, in the meantime, I took the beeswax. I put it into a uh, glass container inside of a pan of hot water, boiling water, to soften the wax up, rolled it between my hands, and formed these, uh, these mouthpieces. And then I, uh, and then I finished the uh, sanding and so on, and now I'm working on painting them. And then I'll be have uh, just about my finished didgeridoo. Didgeridoo. <laughs> Me today, there you go. Thank you very much. 